public space of sensing is not a debt, it is an investment in people, it's an investment in, in communities, and it's an investment in services. People say to us, but what do you say to private sector workers who've got no pension? And yes, we've got a big job of work to do to give pensions justice for everybody. But stealing the pension of a nurse is not going to put right the abuse that's been le levelled on private sector workers. I'm here on behalf of 350 CW members who are striking for fair pay against a bullying employer and a bullying employer called Capita. And they are today taking their fourth day of strike action. And they're taking their fourth day of strike action today because they want to come out and support the wider um, strike in the public sector. And we've had to... Thank you. The real division in society is not between public sector and private sector workers. The real division is between the haves and the half not. We get these gold-plated pensions. This is absolute rubbish. We don't get gold-plated pensions. They're not even plastic-coated pensions in the public sector. So we have to be clear about this. The problem is not that they're cutting too fast and cutting too deep. The problem is that they are cutting at all. That's government. That's government. for these cuts and have been carried out on behalf of a tiny elite at the expense of the overwhelming majority. not for the fact that the Labour Party is committed to protecting corporate interests of the billionaires rather than representing working people. Yeah. Ed, Ed, Ed Miliband said he cannot support this strike. Well, we have a message for Ed Miliband. You're a disgrace. On the 26th of March, we had it in June, we've got it today on the 30th of November, and we're just beginning. We must also organise in our communities too. And I would urge to everybody here today to support not just your trade union, but also support the Bristol Anti-Cuts Alliance, or the Anti-Cuts Alliance in your own hometown. If you don't have an Anti-Cuts Alliance in your own hometown, well, set one up. and strength we've got in our unions and let's call the TUC, call on the TUC in every union to call the next day of action and continue with this programme of action until we get what we want which is fair and decent pensions for all. until we win. And I say, anyone else wants to say a few things? Yeah. Yeah.